truncated domes have several purposes. Um, you know, first and foremost, it, it's a, a non-slip surface. So as you're as you're going from a, a sidewalk into the street, the last thing you want to do is is slip and, and fall into the street. And so, so that's one thing it is, and, and which is why it has to be right at the back of curb is to provide a, a non-slip surface as you're entering into a, a, a roadway. Um, it also provides some contrast to the concrete around it so that people who are visually impaired can can see where that ramp is across the street where that yellow really stands out. They're not all yellow. Um, in Moscow, we've, we've decided to go with that color because it, it does contrast really well from the surrounding area and so people can, can see that. Um, it also, the truncated dome, um, also gives kind of a, a sensory warning to, to visually impaired people that they are on that surface that really is not any light or like any other surface that they're going to feel. So they can definitely feel that truncated dome and know that they're about to enter into a roadway.